All right, everyone, and uh, welcome to your last week. This is it. You made it. And it's going to be an easy one, too. You worked hard. You understand now how much work is involved in being a video game artist. This semester, I try to give you a wide overview of the different jobs you can do in the game industry. The way the class is taught is in purpose that way. By starting with classic pixel art, you understand the basic of art, you know the history and learn how the first games were built artistically, and then you also learn how to get to the essence of your object, which is the same thing that you've done in modeling. In modeling, you're using cubes instead of squares, but you go at a really minimal approach. That's why I built it this way. The seamless texturing, seamless textures, very important, very similar to the texturing of your game. And if you add the shading of the classic pixel art into your texture, that's pretty much it. See what I'm saying? Decals go with the texture too. So the class was really built uh, a certain way, so you learn a wide array of skills, um, and it built on each other's basically and they help you get better as you go now you're gonna go in the last week it's not the most exciting but it could be because it's your last and you've done a lot of work but this is the week where you need to finalize your mesh as you know now game engine are very specific to the hardware and the software they are built with so you need to format your mesh a special way that's what you need to do this week but you also need to do, which is, you need to take your final test. So you have really two things to go to do your work. Week 7, 3D mesh finalization, or week 7, final test. Both of them, you need to go there. And you need to do your work by the end of it. All right, 228. If we look in the mesh finalization, um, you are this week going to clean up your mesh for non 94 objects. A non 94 object is an object that has more than four vertices and four edges. That can also have uh, missing faces or overlapping faces or edges with zero, zero length. Okay, everything is explained uh, in that video right here. All right, this is a lecture. I've added again the game animation principle and 12 principle of animation. If you haven't read them yet from last week, I really want you to do so. It is very important. Um, they are easy to understand, not very easy to apply properly. But your main lecture is the cleaning, formatting, and exporting of your 3D prop for, prop for a video game engine. All right, so you click on that and you will see. The lectures it goes directly all right to uh, that video it's a 10 minutes video something like that all right now you're gonna have some reading to do though when I say no reading that's not true I'll change that right now you have to review everything for your final test but remember the final test is open book all right you can go on the internet you can open your book you can read lectures whatever you want to do that's fine the only thing it is not a group work it is a personal work only you can do it alone. You need to do it alone. All right. Now, assignment seven is very simple. Uh, you are going to do something very important: is to clean up your mesh using the cleanup tool, and then triangulate your mesh so it works in the engine, and then export it. All right, as an FBX format. All right. Uh, FBX is the old film box format, which is now Motion Builder, which is kind of a hub for most of the game engine for animation. That's all you have to do this week. Clean up so it's not, so you don't have any non-manifold. Optimize it as much as possible. Weight versus, uh, poly, uh, <coughs> sorry, polycount versus uh, look. And triangulate it at the end when you're done. You know, make sure the um, UV is still fine. So maybe a little bit of adjustment. And then export it as an FBX. That's all you have to do this week for the homework. All right. But you also have to take your uh, final test. All right. And it is located in week seven. And it is right here. You have 20 questions. It's 70 points. All right. So you review book, 
chapters for finals everything and you review all the lectures uh, uh, as I said here uh, from the beginning of the class for that final test everything included uh, in the test is on the lecture or in the book all right um, thank you very much you did a great job uh, one thing is that um, I hope you guys are not going to stop to 3D until uh, you start 321 with me, uh, which is going to be real soon. Obviously, if you're not taking the next session with me, keep doing 3D. It is not something that stays. You haven't done enough yet for it to stay. All right, so you need to do more and more and more. All right. Um, anyway, I'll see most of you guys uh, and girls uh, in the next session in GIT 312. All right, take it easy. And good luck. You did a fantastic job. It wasn't easy.